I've been thinking for a while now, I've really not taken any time off in the last six months. I've not switched off. I've never been away from YouTube. I've never been away from eBay. I'm always doing something and I felt a little bit burnt out. So it's 5.30 in the morning. We're just starting a new day and I'm just gonna have the day off today. I'm gonna take the camera around. I'm gonna show you exactly what I get up to on a day off. And I think it's really important to really just recognize when you are feeling a little bit burnt out. So I'm gonna go for a surf. I've got Clint, Bree and Paul uh, a couple of my really good mates that are uh, keen to jump in the water and have a bit of a surf this morning. And then we're gonna catch up with Geordie as well, another one of my really good mates, and uh, just grab a coffee with him and catch up, see how he's going. So it's gonna be a fun day. It's just gonna be me doing stuff that I'd wanna do if I ever got a chance to take a day off. I think I definitely need one. So hopefully you enjoy this style of video. Well, I think I've been the main person like in your ear about that. I think sometimes you have been. You just, you just need a, and it doesn't it doesn't have to be like still warm like every day. Like you need every week you need to take day off. It's just like you need to acknowledge at least that yes, I need a day off and have whatever. Even if it's a half day, you know, I'm not looking at my phone for six hours. Kind of sad, like something like that. But you know, with what I'm doing, it's like in your face 24 7 or alert can pop up mm. and you're back on. Mm. So today I'm going to turn off all the notifications. Still yep. haven't done it yet. I don't want to, I don't want to look at YouTube, I don't want to look at eBay. Um, just really chill out. So I'm going to go to Springbrook today, mm. um, which is, I think, the complete, um, I guess, exactly what I'm after in the yeah. sense of just going out. Yeah. Completely just enjoying the trail. I'll take a backpack out there and take some food. I'll try and work on my filming and getting like cool shots Ooh. of like the trees and stuff. That's it. Yeah. Different angles and play around with yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to learn how to edit better. Mm. Adapt like what I really want to do with my editing is get music. Pick a song yeah. for, the, for the video yep. and on the beat of the song adjust the clip. Yep. So I've seen people do that where it's like hard cuts on the beat of the music. Okay. And it just looks complete. So I'll just be playing around with that sort of stuff today. The theme of it is take a break. The vlog continues. Alright, See you, mate. So it was a really good catch up with Jordy. He always gives me good advice. I was just picking his brain on a few things and just how I'm feeling at the moment. So good to catch up with him. Um, this weather has actually taken a turn. If you can have a look here, it's super overcast. See all that cloud? It was a really good morning, but the clouds kind of come over. So the plan was to get out to Springbrook National Park and check out some waterfalls. I've packed a lunch, I've got the backpack on. And uh, I think even though it might be raining this afternoon, I think I'm just gonna do it anyway. It might be a fun one for the vlog. Um, so let's get out, chase some waterfalls, and hopefully, fingers crossed, we can uh, have a good afternoon. Well guys, I think we've made it, but it is incredibly wet out there. That drive up was actually pretty sketchy. The wheels started to slide on the road, but 45 minute drive later, here we are up at the Gold Coast hinterland. So I believe I've parked in the right car park spot. This on a weekend would be absolutely jam packed with people and you're probably likely to not get a parking spot. So benefits, I guess, of coming here on a Tuesday, but I'm gonna find the right hike hiking trail. We're gonna go to Springbrook, um, Purlingbrook Falls. Uh, that's the one we're going to try and get on. So I'm just going to double check to make sure that I am exactly in the right spot, which I think I am. And uh, I'll show you guys this pretty cool setup. Let's do it.
feel like I'm on a school excursion with all of this. Got my little lunchbox. I've got my little water bottle that color coordinated as well. But you need it. When you're out here hiking, you need this sort of stuff. So I guess it's been a pretty hectic six months and I've sort of thought about it recently that I've not really had a day off. I've kind of worked seven days straight for the last six months since I first started doing this full time, this reselling gig. And look, I love it. I have a lot of fun doing it, but I've been feeling over the last couple of weeks a little bit of burnout for the very first time. And I think that's just from overworking, just doing you know eight to 10 hours every single day, just focusing on the same task every single day. I've just felt it a little bit. So I really just wanted to take today where I could just step back, not look at the numbers, not look at my eBay or YouTube analytics, turn off all of my notifications and just go and do fun stuff. I think it's really important if you are trying to do this sort of thing full time, you've also got to remember to take your breaks and just have some time off whenever you can. I know you want to do the best you can. You want to get there as quick as you can, but it's really, really important that you just step back and take some time off. And I think this week, that's what I've realized. I'm about to set off again. And it has just started to pelt down out there. It's so much rain. I think I'm going to get soaked. I did not bring a rain jacket today. I knew it was going to be wet, but I didn't even come prepared. Just an amateur hiker. All right, let's just do it anyway. It's going to be worth it. I promise you, the waterfalls are spot on here. So let's keep going. Well, here's a guy with an umbrella. You're smarter than me, mate. <laughs> <laughs> wet, eh? A bit wet. Is it worth it? Yeah, it's better. Yeah, the waterfalls are really good to see on the water block fire. Nice, mate. Appreciate it. You heard it here first, guys. It's worth it. How good is this? It's really just like a secret gem of Gold Coast. Not too many come out here, not too many people know about it. And if they do, they don't bother coming out. And as you can see behind me, there's every reason to come out here. You can bring a packed lunch, just sit down, chill out, let the world go by. It's an unreal part of the world. So I'm gonna sit down, just chill out for a second. The walk ended up taking about 45 minutes. So it wasn't too much of a hike really at the end of the day. 45 minute walk back. It'll be a bit harder walking back because I'm going to have to go up the mountain. But um, still, it might be one hour on the way back. So, hour 45, it's not too bad. Um, yeah, it's epic here. I've got a YouTube channel. And I'm doing an episode on having a day off. So far, you don't know until you get in the edit. Oh, the channel's doing well, yeah. Yeah, you've just got to be consistent gonna keep uploading but I love it though it's good fun uh, it's the Aussie flipper yeah yeah so I've got a I run a full-time eBay store yeah but I've been doing it non-stop for the last six months so I've literally not taken a day off so I'm like I'm just gonna take a video out and just feel completely different film stuff like this what are you girls doing Not bad for a day off. You're on. You're on. What are you going to say? So I got Millie. Hi. And I got Sarah up the back Hi. there. There she is. So a couple of travelers that I found on this hike and we almost thought we went the wrong way for a second, but now we've found some really cool rock pools. So we just, we're having an hour Do we actually go in? Why not? That's the question. <laughs> what do you reckon, Sarah? Are, my shoes are already off. I think we need to go in. Well, we need to go in. <laughs> So there it is there. We just tested it and the water is relatively fresh. Not super fresh, but relatively fresh. So I think we might. Are we going to give it a go? Yeah. All right. All right, I'll set the camera up and let's, let's just do it. It's a day off, isn't it?
So how are we feeling after the rock pools? We are feeling refreshed. Ah, <laughs> definitely, definitely worthwhile. I wasn't, I wasn't convinced initially. <laughs> the girls have taught me into it. Mm -hmm. This is crazy. So I think we're done. I think we're only maybe a couple of minutes away from mm -hmm. getting back to the car park. Only a few leeches on us. A few leeches. These girls are going to go back. Yeah, we are we are covered in leeches. Yeah. But well worth it though, it was a lot of fun. <laughs> Girls gotta drive back to Brisbane now, so they got one hour's worth of freezing in the car. Yeah. But very, very worth much it. worth it. Worth Definitely. Stoked to bump into you guys. <laughs> Stoked. Bye. We are done. <laughs> We're done. Oh hey, successful day. <laughs> nice to meet you guys. Yeah, very nice to meet you. Now. Lovely to meet yeah. you. Remember to uh, like and subscribe as always. Oh, like Absolutely. and subscribe, guys. The Aussie Flipper. It's an yeah. easy one to find. <laughs> yeah. All good, guys. No worries. Nice to meet you. Man, that was super fun. What an afternoon. Just really random, obviously, to bump into a couple of cool people that are doing a, a very similar thing, just having a day off and trying to have some fun. And obviously, company really does help. And that's why I wanted to go out and catch up with Geordie today for a coffee. It's why I wanted to get in the water for a surf with Bree, Clinton, Paul. Just having my mates around me, having people around me, you can get very isolated doing this reselling gig and to actually be able to spend time with people during your day. It's not common in what we do. And to be honest, I've probably battled with it a little bit in not having that workmate or that, you know, that companion in there doing the job with you when I've been doing my reselling. So, you know, for, for something like today where you get a day off and you can go out and spend time with your friends, meet random people and, and have a fun experience, I think that's what I mean by having a day off and just chilling out, getting away from it, just enjoying time off. Um, it's a random Tuesday, but I've enjoyed every single bit of it. It's now four o'clock, so I'm gonna end the video there. I'm gonna go home and edit the video, so technically I am working, but this was a really fun day and I needed this. And like I said earlier, you've just gotta know when to pull up and take a break. Um, do whatever you like to do for time off. If that's just spending it at home and watching TV, just switch off, just turn the notifications off, and just chill out for a little bit. I've really enjoyed not looking at YouTube analytics, not looking at eBay, not responding to any messages, just tuning off and uh, going out and getting out into the uh, into the rainforest, checking out a cool waterfall and meeting new people. So I'm feeling pretty good. I'm ready to jump back into it tomorrow. I'm ready to get back into it on Thursday for another video, trip to the thrift. It's probably gonna be my best one yet because I've had this break. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this style of video guys. It's obviously a you know a vlog style which was received fairly well last week when I did a vlog um, more or less for the very first time. But let me know if you want me to do this sort of thing, not so much maybe a day off but reselling vlogs um, on a weekly basis. I'm, I'm happy to do it. I enjoy making these sorts of videos so um, hopefully you get something out of it today. Um, let me know. Are you feeling burnt out? Are you feeling like you need a break? Do you work too hard? It'd be, it'd be cool to know in the comments because you know, sometimes you can feel like you're the only one doing it. And obviously I know there's an awesome community out there, but to get like-minded people feeling the same way, it'd be cool to connect in the comments. So let me know. But um, that'll do me, guys. I'm freezing. It is pelting outside. There's so much rain. I want to get home, have a shower, get warm, edit this video, and we're done for the day. So appreciate you tuning in, guys. Look forward to catching you in the next one. Back to reseller-related content. And uh, I look forward to doing a trip to the thrift on Thursday with you. Thanks for tuning into this one, guys. We'll see you in the next.